Good afternoon everyone and welcome to Friday's edition of Storytime. Now I was hoping to have a special guest to join me for Storytime today, but baby Isabel decided she'd rather have a sleep instead, so it's just me. Now today's book is going to continue with the animal theme this week and it's going to be called Little Monkey, which sometimes is what baby Isabel is, a little monkey. So let's begin. Monkey loved living in the jungle. There were so many things to do and so many things to see. But every now and then, oof, things went a bit wrong. Monkey had a little problem. And the problem was being little. Some days everything was out of reach. Other days, it was out of sight. Things were always too deep, too dangerous and too difficult for someone so little. No, you can't climb up here. Monkey was fed up with always missing out. So one day, she made a decision. A very brave and a very big decision. I will climb to the top of the tallest tree. The jungle is not too big for me. You'll see. I wonder if he manages to succeed. If he spot any dangers lurking in the trees. It wasn't an easy journey. Not easy at all. The river was deep and dangerous. The path was often difficult. But Monkey would not give up. And step by step. She found her way. Everywhere Monkey looked, she noticed little things. And the little things did amazing things. Now it's my turn, she said. So Monkey began to count. One, two, three. Who's too little now? Not me. Soon Monkey had reached the very bottom of the tallest tree in the jungle. This will be fun, she said, and she began to climb. Up she went, climbing higher and higher. Can you spot the danger yet? Right to the very top. The world below looked so little and so beautiful. Finally, Monkey could see everything, including the rest of her troop. They look very excited to see me. She's waving back. It must be time to go, thought Monkey. And she swung down from the tallest tree, feeling very, feeling very pleased and very proud. Monkey did love living in the jungle now more than ever before. I may be small, but I'm very brave, she said. And very lucky, said the rest of the troop. Little Monkey knew they were right, because the smaller you are, the larger your adventures can be. But best of all, the bigger the hugs feel. I hope you enjoyed that story time. Have a lovely weekend everyone and we'll see you next week. Bye!